storms that was leaving Trutland County earlier with a severe thunderstorm warning has made its way on off toward the coast. But you can see listening to things that matter to the community and combating criminal activity. Last Thursday, deputies arrested 16 suspects during what they call a street sweep. Charges range from drug possession to traffic violations. Mahone and Jack Hees Moody were both arrested. Plus, there's another hat in the ring. Meet the latest Republican to announce a run for the GOP presidential nomination. When Eyewitness News at 10 on The CW continues. Hey folks, Levin Holliman here at Butler Nissan. Do you think you might have a little bit of a credit issue? If Drug or alcohol dependency can be a hard thing to come to terms with. It can affect your job destroy your marriage, and ruin your life. This is the spot. No security cameras till the end of the alley. You certain? 100% ma'am. Come in. I got here as fast as I could. Oh, thanks, Lisa. I want on that, you can go to our website, WGXA.TV. A four-year-old in South Carolina opened a lemonade stand to raise money for the Charleston Emanuel AME Church. Mallory Metz wants to give back to the church. With mom's help every Saturday, she opens up for business. Art, music, hilarity. Hop into bed with Jimmy Kimmel Live tonight on ABC. Up next on WGXA News at 11, the Macon Bib Commission is set to discuss using drones to enhance emergency response capabilities. Hear the reaction from the man offering his drones for the new service. Plus, a border battle, the arguments people in two central Georgia counties are making in the Supreme Court of Georgia. And deputies want to keep everyone safe on the road. Young drivers tell us what they learned in the defensive driving class. We had triple digits today. What about tomorrow? Find out next at 11. Premier event Sunday, August 2nd on ABC. You're watching WGXA, ABC 16 Macon. Now, news that works for you. This is WGXA News. Coming up on ABC 16, a Central Georgia City Council. Good evening and thanks for watching ABC 16. I'm Raymond Tubb and this is news that works for you. New at 11. The city of Byron passed a dangerous dog ordinance tonight, but that's not the end of the story. Oprah Winfrey said, you got to move. She started moving, became a billionaire, and lost a bunch of weight, too, at the same time. You see? Word. Thank you. Are you having problems with the IRS? Liens and levies, garnishments, seizures, penalties. Are you being audited? Bambi? <laughs> Are you there, Bambi? Yeah, I think she ran back into the forest. Armed robbery. We're told two men walked into Kim's Fashions and Internet Cafe on Bloomfield Road in Macon Sunday afternoon. They also got away with an undisclosed amount of money. A prayer vigil was held today at the God's Power Church of Christ. Members wanted this service to represent their stand against crime. 41 NBC's Alexa Rodriguez has the story. This is just a building. We know that we are the church. The Power in Houston County to check out a school program that helps students be what they want to be when they grow up. Those stories and more are coming up on the news at 10. Watch Bounce TV on 41.3, serving Macon and all of Middle Georgia. Hi, I'm Fred Bronick, independent insurance agent since 1990. Get ready to write down. This test paper represents proteins in your skin. Watch it react to direct contact with ordinary soap. Soap. You can't fake a praise. 
It don't feel good when it gets up in your camp, but it's necessary. Do I have a witness? Dale un aplauso al Señor. Pastor, pero si ya estoy en un lugar...